in there. Cut the camera, boy. guys just finished up an awesome awesome training session at 24 hour fitness nice facility so I have to head over get ready for the big training symposium tonight at 7 p.m. all right guys I'll check in with you later peace All the way. All right, all, all the way, way from Sweden. Sweden. Yeah, what's yeah. your name? Johan. Johan. Sebastian. Sebastian, my whole name. Mike Lee. Mike Lee, nice to meet you. Mike man. Lee, nice thin life, you, baby. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's get it started. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm 
sorry. There's actually, I'm sorry, there's, there's a space in here. There's three lifters in here. Man. What's up guys, Mike Lee here. So heading into day two of the Olympia. So my day one thoughts is that, wow, the Olympia is such a big event, the Expo. You know, there's so much to see, so many vendors. Like the convention center is over 400,000 square feet. And every inch of the convention center is full of vendors so it literally takes about two days to see everything so i'll be at the isatory booth uh booth 332 right next to uh i think bsn they have a huge huge booth so cp fletcher will be there today brian shaw will be here again today so come by and see me i have good things for you let's talk about getting you some great supplements in your hand you some great isatory stuff Stuff that I actually use, you know, I use Isotory every day. I use Bioactive Way after my workouts. I use Maxon, I use their pre-workout. So it's a brand that I believe in, trust in, I use to get these little gains. I got little gains. So come by guys, if you're at the Olympia, come by and see me, got this stuff for you. And um, I'm just love sharing everything with you guys. Actually, I'm gonna head down there a little earlier today so I can maybe get some videos and pictures with some of the fitness celebrities there before all the fans come in. So I'm giving you guys full access to everything I do. So I'll check in with you guys in a little bit. This is... All right, we at the Olympia, baby. Team Isatory. It's busy here. It hasn't even started yet, so. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm here with Legendary. Mr. Olympia, the best Mr. Olympia ever, ever, Mr. Lee Haney. And I want to ask you just one quick tip. Can you just give us one quick tip about fitness, something you learned in your life that you would never go without? Well, Michael, what I would say to you guys out there, make sure you take care of your health. Your health is your wealth. If you want to live long and prosper, you got to be in good health. So let's be intentional about eating the right things, about getting regular exercise, and staying on top of it. Michael's a man. He's been there, done that. I've never done a fat boy like him. So, <laughs> so he can tell you something. I can't. You guys take care and be black. Hey, guys, that's it. That's the tip from the man, Mr. Lee Haney. Thank you, sir. All right, Appreciate it. Enjoy the Olympia. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm here with my beautiful friend, Ms. Marlo. Hi. Uh, Magnum sponsored athlete, and I just want to ask you, what's one quick fitness tip that you can give to the ladies to help them work on their fitness, up their fitness game? What could you tell them today that will just help them? Quick tip? Yeah, um, honestly, I think just get outside of your comfort zone. Like a lot of people just kind of do the same thing over and over again, and, and people are kind of scared to try something new because they're worried to look like an idiot or something in the gym. And to be honest, um, people get intimidated in the gym. People are not looking at you. Seriously, like people are in their zone. Get out of your comfort zone. Like ask people at the gym. Most people are very accommodating. They want to help you, and uh, I want to help people all the time. I'm just nervous to go up because I don't. I don't want to feel like I'm offending someone yeah. if I'm trying to give you a tip. I just. I really want to help you. So get out of your comfort zone. Try something new and up your fitness game. There you go. I could have said it better myself, Miss Marlo. Can you throw out your IG so they can follow you? Yeah. Uh, follow me on Instagram at mlo will and uh, yeah. Rising star in the fitness industry, one of my favorite peeps. Thank you for it. Hey, who, who, hey, hey now! Look right! No, it's pre-workout time! Kill 
Olympia. Nothing with this monster. 332. So I'm with my homeboy Brandon Carter, man. Roll out, man. This guy is doing it amazing. He's so successful. He's he built his business from the ground up. He's, he's just awesome. And can you give a few of his one quick tip about business if there's something that helped you? What kind of question that you want to ask? You know, like it's all about the same thing. We like, I eat good, or I train good, or I work out, and it's like this. It's not, they're not focused enough. And I don't have to be consistent. So like the problem is, anything you consistent with, you will make progress. And that's going for bad shit, you know? right? So it's consistent. I guess what's it? Be consistent. But don't do it at all. But you know, as you heard it, big yeah. Brandon Carter, man, this guy is going to be. I'm here with Cali Muscle, legend in the game, legend in the game. I just wanted to ask you, what's one quick tip you can give the viewers about fitness that's helping you in your life and helping you where you are today? Discipline. That's the main thing. You gotta have discipline to be successful in anything you do in life. So, you know, a lot of people don't have discipline for food. You know, a lot of people, number one drug is food. So. You gotta get that discipline down back and everything else from there fall in place. You know, everybody coming up, oh, I fell off the wagon or what? Well, hey, you're not disciplined. Get disciplined in your life and you'll progress in life. You heard it from the man himself, Cali Muscle. Thank yes, you for sir. all the motivation and daily motivation. Yes, sir. Keep up with Cali Muscle. Thank you, Cali. Oh, yeah, we up in there. Cut the camera, boy. Let's keep it tracking.